So now I'd like to welcome to the stage a dear friend of mine, a woman who gives her all, not just for NATCA, but for the NACA Charitable Foundation. Her compassion and caring for our members and our communities is simply outstanding. So please welcome to the stage, NACA Charitable Foundation Vice President, Betsy Beaumont. Good morning. A little background for those of you who have never been introduced to our charity. The NACA Charitable Foundation is a nonprofit 501c3 corporation that works to make a difference in the lives of many. NCF is a 100% volunteer organization and we literally could not be successful without them. NCF seeks out smaller charities that help underserved in communities across the United States. This amazing charity was started by a small group of air traffic controllers and their spouses who realized that as individuals we could make small changes, but as a larger group we could make an impact on a national level. I've personally watched this charity grow from a few thousand dollars to one over $300,000, and I've been honored to be a part of it. At our annual meeting last year, the NCF board was unanimous in agreeing that we had two outstanding individuals that we wish to honor. Please hold your applause until I name them both. The first volunteer that we would like to recognize is a beautiful example of what NCF represents. She has continually volunteered her time and energy to numerous events, even when she was very pregnant which any woman who has dealt with that situation knows it is no small feat. She is also one of the kindest and sweetest souls that you will ever meet. When you ask her to do any task, she never questions or complains. She jumps into the project and never looks back. Genesis and her husband actively work with a local charity that ensures the youth in an underprivileged area so that they have an after-school activity that keeps them healthy and out of trouble. Genesis Garcia is a shining example of what NCF represents, the heart, and it is with great pleasure that we recognize her as one of our recipients. Unfortunately, Genesis was unable to attend this event, but we'll be sure that she sees the video. Our NCF president said when she first met this next person at a planning event, this individual was a whirlwind of passion and dedication to everything she touched. After meeting and working with her, I could not agree more. During the Fort Lauderdale Convention, not only did she help lead the planning and execution of the convention, but in every spare moment, she also helped to plan fundraisers for NCF. When she was not helping the convention committee at events, she was jumping every time she saw a need to help the NCF volunteers. She constantly checked in to see if the volunteers needed anything or to see how she could help make our jobs easier. Through numerous other events, she has continued to volunteer to help plan fundraisers and help the board shop for auction items and pitch in in any way that she literally could. When faced with a task or challenge, she rises to the occasion and doesn't just complete or overcome, she masters the task to perfection or even meets the challenge head on and soars above it with grace and enthusiasm. Not only does she volunteer, she is also the type of person to call and check in on you just to ask how you are doing. She cares about others. She is compassionate. She's dedicated to her union and the causes of NCF in helping others. If you have the pleasure of knowing or working, sorry, or working with Amy Sayers, you know how incredible of a human being she is. You love her just as much as our charity does. Amy, thank you for everything you do to help make NCF to give back to the lives of others and to improve the quality of life in our country. Amy Sayers, please come forward. You know, we have a beautiful award, and it, <laughs> it's literally in the, it's a, a red blown heart, and it says our heroes have heart, but it, because it's very delicate, we're going to have it sent straight to our house. <laughs> 